Monday, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Windows 11 24H2, which is this year's annual feature update, is soon to be released to the general public. And I would suggest, as I've posted previously, that Microsoft will start rolling out this year's annual feature update starting next week, Tuesday, the 24th of September, using a controlled rollout. And I'll leave a video I posted on this um, recently linked down below and in the end screen if you'd like some more info. Now, in regards to version 24H2, Microsoft has announced that this year's annual feature update will also improve the out-of-box experience, also known as, as the OOBE for short. And what it's going to do in a nutshell, it's going to improve the security of the operating system even before the setup process is complete, which is currently not the case. Now, currently in Windows, when you are setting up a new installation, um, the OS, as soon as you boot into Windows for the first time, will then start checking for Windows updates, or you will then have to come also check for updates. But normally, if there are critical updates, the OS will start downloading those only after the setup process, the out-of-box experience is complete and you boot into Windows. Now, this is where it's all going to change with 24H2, where Microsoft has announced, and I'm quoting, they say that critical drive updates and critical Windows zero-day patch updates will begin downloading automatically during OOBE after the user has connected to a network. And I think this is a good thing because it's just going to patch any holes that may uh, be available security-wise even before the setup process is complete. So when you get into the actual operating system, when it boots into Windows for the first time um, after the OOBE in Windows 11 version 24H2, any critical security holes have been patched and I think it will make the OS a lot more secure, which currently is not the case. And Microsoft also says the user can't opt out of these critical updates as they are required for the device to operate properly. And they also mentioned that Windows will alert the user that the device is checking for and applying the updates. And this is all taking place during the OOBE. So it doesn't say that all updates will be downloaded and installed. It just says critical driver updates, which are obviously needed for the OS to function properly and also for security and Windows zero day patch updates. So that will be a lot of the more important security updates that have rolled out, obviously to patch any security flaws or holes in the OS even before the setup process is complete. So that's another improvement we can expect to see with Windows 11 24H2. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.